they may be that match made in heaven, and I hope that they have a wonderful day. Sister Wives star Mary Brown couldn't have done it better if she had a team of PR people working for her. But instead, she had a secret weapon during the hiatus between seasons from the TLC series. No, instead she has Jen Sullivan as her best friend and someone who seems to always have her back, both on and off her reality show. Just recently, things were on the cusp of going sideways for her. That is until Jen jumped in and set things straight. Sister Wives, Mary Brown had no idea? Mary Brown parting ways with Amos Andrews is old news. While she addressed this breakup with her fans, she also had to take into consideration what her fans knew about Amos by the time she announced the split. The mess started as soon as Mary revealed her new boyfriend to his Sister Wives fans. This prompted critics to dig deep, which allegedly led them to some less than stellar findings about the guy. Some of the things said could fall under rumors, but others, such as four divorces, would come with documentation. So it's hard to put several divorces under the category of rumors. So, as a new girlfriend, she had gushed about this guy. She even alluded to him as her new love interest, without using the word love. That worked out as a good thing for her because her best pal, Jen Sullivan, picked up on that. Jen also used it to rescue her best friend in a big way. Many Sister Wives fans surmised that Mary Brown found herself blindsided by the reports about Amos. If she knew about his alleged past beforehand, she likely wouldn't have put him on her live Fridays with friends. But she did, and she even planted one huge kiss on the guy as the camera rolled. The fans were privy to her behaviors, so to them, she looked quite serious in this relationship. Mary slammed all the brakes. Once Mary Brown's boyfriend's alleged past deeds made the headlines, this didn't put him in a good light with the sister wives' followers. Then Mary became suspiciously quiet online, even skipping her Friday show. So fans surmised she was keeping to herself because of the awful stuff swirling around online about her new beau. When she did return, she took things slowly. After going public with her new boyfriend, the next time she did her Friday show, she told fans that he got scared away. She said nothing else regarding the man she gushed over when she introduced him to Sister Wives fans. So fans took this as a hint that they parted ways. Next, she posted a lot of cryptic messages about personal growth, which all pointed to Mary Brown being single again. So it was as if she was trying to prepare her fans for her announcement. Mary Brown finally posted a message revealing that she called it quits with Amos. So in the aftermath, fans assumed she jumped the gun and didn't vet this guy before making her relationship public. Sister Wives fans thought she acted as if she were madly in love with him during that one Friday with Friends venue she had him on. But when Mary came clean about parting ways with the guy, some Sister Wives fans took it upon themselves to offer reprimands. They started to shake that proverbial finger at her. Some even tried to shame the original Sister Wives matriarch for being fooled a second time while trying to find love. She was catfished years back, and now this, so some fans suggested she is just too gullible. Fans asked questions during Mary Brown's Fridays with Friends show, with Jen Sullivan as her co-host. Then one fan asked Mary why her new love didn't show up on the show again. Jen jumped on that. She slammed that question, but she did so nicely. Jen was adamant when stating no one said anything about love. She played this down for Mary. So by the time Jen was done, you were left with the impression that Mary was only dating Amos and nothing more. So Jen left fans with the impression that Amos was nothing more than casual dating for Mary Brown. That seemed to do the trick, as Mary no longer seemed to get reprimanded on social media for her choice of men. Plus, headlines dried up about her choice of a now ex-boyfriend. Instead, fans seemed to follow Jen's lead and side with Mary. Some even felt sorry for her that it didn't work out. But most now give her thumbs up for recognizing the problem and then moving on. So Mary Brown has a guardian angel as a best friend and fans hope to see more of Jen Sullivan on the TLC series.
Head back to Silk Dirt for the latest buzz on Sister Wives. My Kelty Brown, profoundly known for her appearance on the reality TV show Sister Wives, recently took to her Instagram stories to point out trolls who had been making belittling comments about her husband Tony's looks, particularly his long hair. With her three offspring, Avalon, Archer, and Ace, playing around her in the living room, the 27-year-old TLC celebrity delivered a message to her followers. She said, If my husband needs a haircut, it's nobody's business but mine and his, so maybe stop commenting about it. My Kelty expressed her distress and frustration with the continuous backlash she and Tony received regarding their appearance. She concludes her rant by urging people to remember, If you don't have anything nice to say, just don't say anything at all. Sadly, this isn't the first time my Kelty has had to defend her family against unsolicited comments from online trolls. Just last month, she reacted to a fan who questioned why her twin baby boys had different hair colors. My Kelty's straightforward reply was a reminder that every human is created differently. My Kelty, the daughter of Christine and Kobe Brown, has faced both criticism and praise from fans. She recently drew positive attention for her significant weight loss, a journey that she embarked on after welcoming her twins in November 2022. The Brown couple are also parents to Aspen, 28, Peyton, 25, Wendlin, 21, Isabel, 20, and Truly, 13.